So hi, this is Jess from the Backstage Access, here with Estiva. Yeah. We're at Amsterdam Dance Event 2018. You just played at a State of Trance streaming. How was it? It was cool. It was very busy. I mean, uh, usually people, uh, the day starts a little bit later because everyone's going out and then, but uh, yeah, today was early and it was full. Um, so yeah, I played uh, some new tracks. New tracks so tell us something about those new tracks. Um, well, there were three new tracks in my mini set and uh, I think that is 10% of all the new music I have. So uh, yeah, it's it's melodic, but also very banging, very techno-ish. Um, I like it and I hope that people like it too. When are they going to be released? I don't know. I have no Still. idea. <laughs> I don't even know if they will ever be, be released. Be released yeah. Yeah. And last time we talked, you told me that you have plenty of material for another album. Yeah. Soon. Spectacle too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Any news on the uh, coming no. out? Not yet. No, we need to sit down uh, with the statement and then um, we need to uh, make a, a track selection and then plan the whole thing. New artwork and um, it's something for early. Got to be careful. Early next year. Yeah, could be done. Early next year. Yeah. We're waiting. <laughs> be patient, please. Yes, but not that much. So please. <laughs> <laughs> so, anything, anything new you have in store for us in terms of gigs or uh, touring? I don't know something. Uh, yeah, I've uh, my November schedule is pretty busy. I have Dream State in. Uh, San Bernardino, is that? So mm-hmm. Southern California. Uh, Dream Fields in Mexico, which I'm looking forward to because uh, it's always nice to be touring with people you know rather than just travel oh, around the world so. alone. And uh, next month's going to be a lot of mm-hmm. uh, fun travels. Do you always have the time to? Do you also have the time to take some uh, some kind of holiday, some a few days off? When Sometimes uh, this summer I had uh, I did uh, Ibiza uh, on Wednesdays, and the last one was in uh, September, and I extended my stay for uh, two two more nights, and I was uh, I booked a villa with friends, so we had some time off and could relax together and see my friends and. Uh, barbecue and uh, yeah loved it it makes it more bearable yeah I guess, yeah when but yeah but usually it's just going to that city and then wake yeah. up and going to another city or back home and then back home is always nice yes of course and mm, well I'm asking you this because uh, we were reading in these days that the uh, hardware is quitting maybe that mouse is quitting as well um, so many huge artists are deciding to live in for personal issues or mm-hmm. something like that so how hard is it to travel a lot and to manage all the pressure and everything well I think it's different for everyone uh, and uh, I can't really compare myself with Hartwell or any uh, other people that travel so much uh, but um, yeah I think you got to be care- very careful and listen to your own mm-hmm. body and you got to have people around you that um, tell you when it's enough um, But yeah, it's, it's, it's difficult because if you're an artist, you want to do as much shows as, as, you, as you can mm. because it's fun and yeah, because you, it's your passion. So um, it's understandable that it's hard to say no. Um, I don't know in, in, in all those specific cases what was the reason to, uh, to quit, but um, if, if you feel like you need to slow down, then it's probably the right thing. Yeah. I think so too. You have to listen to your body, to your mind. Yeah. If it requires a stop, yeah. there's a time to do that. So, but you're having fun, so promise us you're keeping going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as long as I have time to, to be in the studio as well and to relax yeah. a bit, I'm, I'm all good. Yeah. What is the, the funniest part of your job? Actually, being in the studio and then bringing the end result into a club. And to see how I was like, I, it's always funny to play a track for the first time because people usually they 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 like to hear what they already mm-hmm. know or they like to hear something that they that they understand. And if you play something completely new, you can almost see people think on the dance floor. Like, hey, 
what is this? I don't know this. Yeah. That's always the most fun part. And if, yeah. if, like, if you play it a few times and people get used to it, and then I like playing ideas. Yeah, just testing out new music. Yeah, it's it, it's, it's, a lot it's of fun always for me. good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay then. So thanks a lot for your time. Thank you. Hope to see you soon. Yeah. See you soon. And have fun during this Amsterdam dance event. I will. Okay. I will get some sleep as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure. <laughs>